Hello and welcome back to another card opening video. I thought we were done with Topps Chrome Update 2020, but uh, our Target here in town restocked, and not only did they restock, they uh, have now implemented the three item limit for cards. And so, uh, so why are you saying, why do I have maybe four? So, I bought three one of the days, and then I went back the next morning, and they had still three more, and so I bought another three. Uh, and I actually opened up two of them off camera, and so I opened up probably all in all, maybe five or six mega boxes. I never pulled an auto, but of course, in the two value packs that I had opened off camera, of course, I pull an auto in one. It's a Jack Mayfield sticker auto rookie, but... It's a rookie auto. I will certainly take it. So pretty happy about that. But I decided to save the other two, uh, or some other four, um, for a video. And we're going to see if my conspiracy theory is still correct. That you get maybe uh, some better pulls in the value packs than you do uh, the, the mega boxes that we have here. So, like, if you look at the odds like on the packs those don't really I'm actually just gonna maybe open up all these at once if you look at the odds those it, it doesn't really support my claim um of that but for some reason that's the case uh but yeah i've got uh 2021 series one jumbo and hobby boxes uh up on the youtube channel uh, ended up buying another hobby box, or excuse me, jumbo box for myself. Thought about doing it on the channel, but decided against it. Uh, opened that for myself. I got a John Cruck auto. Um, do, 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 do. Let's uh, let's just start at the top. We'll just do it this way. We'll just work our way down that way. So we'll get some pinks in there. Got a John Cruck auto. Got a Christian Yelich uh, manufactured like jersey cap. I don't have it next to me, but uh, that was numbered out of ten, so that was a pretty uh, successful box um, with that. After that, and right off the bat, we have Luis Robert. I need to get some stands up on here. Uh, so I've got Prim. I think I still have not hit a Trent Grisham. So I guess I'm looking for Grisham. And after that, I've pretty much hit everybody else. So I guess just looking for more Randys, more of this guy. Uh, it feels weird to have in a product that's out that has him in a rookie card and then have another product without him in a rookie card, which is 2021 Series 1. But also, uh, probably next video after this, is, and I'm probably actually going to film right after this too, maybe come up on different days, or post on different days, but it's going to be a retail, I guess, review break of 2021 Series 1. Got a regular, uh, like... Gravity pack, got a fat pack, a uh, hanger box, and then a blaster as well. So that'll be the first retail uh, I'll be opening. Nice Kyle Lewis rookie debut. Uh, I'm going to sleeve that. I don't know if I've sleeved it in other videos, but I like Kyle Lewis. My brother's a big fan. I'll sleeve Kyle Lewis. If we get um, some repeats, I'll just cover them up again. Nico Horner. Decades next is a nice card. All right, first pink pack. Didn't see any of the hanger boxes for Chrome Update. They had the pink waves. I'm kind of more interested in the waves um, than just you know the normal pinks. Well, it's just this because they look a little bit different. Hunter Pence and Kenta Maeda. Nothing. That's there. One of those gentlemen are retired, that being Hunter Pence. Uh, may had an okay season up in Minnesota. Kyle Lewis, decades and next. I'll sleeve that one later. Not worthy of a stand today. With the limited space I have. Cunha, Divi Grion. Kyle Ripken Jr. on the back, if I can get those cards out of there. Yachty, usual. Luzardo, rookie debut, aforementioned. Cal Ripken Jr. Next pink pack. So I'm gonna, I'm, 
I said it last time, but I'm going to assume this is uh, it for Topps Chrome Update. I don't see it really being stocked all that much, and I'm not going to go spend secondary prices for stuff. Starlin Castro is our first pink, and Cody Stoshik is our next. At least it's a rookie. Brendan Rogers decades next. Didn't know he had a card in here. Jordan Alvarez rookie debut is a nice one. Then we have Pete Alonso All Star game with the gold cup on there. I'll sleeve up Jordan. I think I maybe have gotten one other Jordan um, rookie debut. And it still is. I mean, people have mentioned it, but so weird to see like you know just base cards now of him and Kyle Lewis and Luis Robert and all those other rookies that were last year. Now they just have their uh, future stars cards. Aguilar, Crone, Verdugo. I remember last time we got lucky with uh, that CJ Crone. Usually the Randy was right behind it. Didn't get it this time. Dyson. Kyle Lewis. Is that another Kyle Lewis? Zach Davies. So I think that's what now two decades next Kyle Lewis's. Next paint. After this will be three-fourths of the way done. Bryce and Mark McGuire. Might be some value for Mark McGuire fans for that pink. Maybe an 80s fan. Have an Aquino rookie debut on the back. Ripken. And there's the Aquino. Maybe uh, maybe a year ago you were sleeve stand worthy, but not so much. He even still has a base card in 2021. Um, series one, which is, I don't know, I just feel like he's kind of really fallen off the map. Agazal, Key Henderson, there's Cy Sneed, refractor of a, excuse me, a card that we pulled a refractor of last time in the Mega Box. A nice pull. Pence again, Maeda, Mejia, that has that spring training ish background that looks very similar to Randy and Todd Frazier. So, no, uh, we're done with the base stuff, so it doesn't look like I'm still going to get a Grisham through all this. I still have not pulled a Grisham. But our last two pinks, Kipnis and Nestor Cortez. So, uh, all in all, started off pretty pretty strong with uh, Luis Robert and Kyle Lewis rookie debuts. There's all the damage. Um, but, yeah, we're just going to have our uh, three rookie debuts. There's Jordan. There's Kyle Lewis. There's a good old Lou Bob. I think it maybe makes three or four now of these that I have. So I've done pretty well on those. But so let me know uh, what you thought your favorite card was down in the comments below. You can like it. You can dislike it. You can subscribe. You know how YouTube works. You can do all those fun things. But until next time, we'll see you later. Bye.